Well, it's Super Bowl weekend, and SD and Lola couldn't be more excited. Without further ado, here's the Super Bowl edition of the News Hounds. Esty couldn't be more excited about the Super Bowl without the Packers playing. Esty, wake up. Time for animal predictions. Tula, the 15-month-old orangutan at the Salt Lake City Zoo, had to choose between two paper mache helmets. He's going with the Carolina Panthers. Esty, contain your excitement. Lola found Misha, a 257-pound tiger, at Des Moines Bank Park Zoo. Sticking with her relatives, Misha's going with the Panthers, of course. Misha's favorite team, the Bengals, aren't an option this year. How about you, Esty? Any picks? Okay, off to Zoo Montana now. Ozzy, the 700-pound grizzly bear here, has made his annual prediction. When faced with the choice of two delicious banana cakes with peanut butter frosting, Ozzy's going with the Broncos. Ozzy has a two and one record in picking the winner. The last time he lost, he picked the Broncos. We'll see. SD, one last pick. This groundhog in North Carolina, home to the Panthers, had to choose between two ears of corn. He betrayed the hometown fans and picked Denver. So it's two and two in our critter prognosticators. The air is thick with excitement. Here, Esty, maybe this will perk you up. They held a sneak peek of the Puppy Bowl in San Francisco. Two teams took to the field for a scrimmage. The Puppy Bowl is more than just fun, games, and cuteness. It's a way to remind people to adopt dogs from their local shelters. You can check out the Puppy Bowl Sunday at 2 on Animal Planet. And not to be outdone, the Kitten Bowl airs Sunday on the Hallmark Channel. Nearly 100 rescue kitties fill up Hallmark's bite-sized football field, complete with scratchy goalposts and plenty of toys. NFL great Boomer Esiason is the Feline Football League Commissioner. And it's something that I take very seriously, and I was so proud when I was offered the job a year ago. And uh, I've learned so much that uh, I just felt like this was just a natural now. And Lola reports all of the kittens are winners. The show was taped in October, and every single kitty has been adopted. Talk about a touchdown. And that's this week's edition of the News Hounds. Oh, SD. <laughs> he had a procedure. He had a chest x-ray and ultrasound, so he was a little... They up. gave him something to a calm little, little down. Sedative, oh, it was so funny. But he's all better now. That's good. That's right. good. He's a good sport.